I spent the day trying my hand at the hardcore, eclipsed only Iron Man challenge. The rules are exactly the same as before. Visit each moon in order and only once. This time, the twist is that we'll be using the eclipse only mod by Stormy Tuna. This just makes it so every single moon is always eclipsed. The hardcore part also means that we cannot die once. With that in mind, this is my best attempt of the day and I thought it was a really fun run. I had interactions with almost every enemy in the game and I finally completed a goal I've been trying to achieve for a while. But with all that said, subscribe or I'm going to create a group chat and purposely not include you. So today we are doing the hardcore Iron Man challenge. Um, this will be the la one of the last times you'll see the Iron Man challenge on this channel, I think, because maybe not one of the last times, but this is kind of like not the end all be all either, but there's not too much I can do beyond this. Yes, there is. There's obviously difficulty spikes and we can do it with Brutal Company and stuff like that, but I just kind of wanted to try some other ideas after this one. But since um, the Iron Man challenge has gotten pretty popular and a lot of people enjoy it, I decided that I would give my best attempt at the hardcore Iron Man challenge. It's honestly, I've done like six or seven attempts so far. It's honestly easier than uh, my last, my last real challenge, which was the Iron Man with the uh, We Need to Go Deeper mod. Which, yeah, if you haven't seen, check it out. But yeah, so we start off on company building, uh, so we're not wasting any... Basically, I don't want to attract any of the dogs by ordering items on other planets. So we land at the company to safely get our items. And now we start off with my least one of my least favorite maps, Experimentation. Also, it's important to note that I'm actually using push to talk mode in the game so I can talk to you guys while um, I'm walking around, you know, dogs and stuff. Just so you can kind of hear my thoughts and so yeah. Experimentation, I have very low hopes for this map or for this moon. We really just want to get around 150 scrap and it's a pretty good start if we do that. Bunker spider. We're actually gonna keep them there for a minute. There's like no items in the front. I think we should just go fire exit instead. I'm not gonna bother with the bunker spider right now. Let's just go fire exit since there's no <coughs> items immediately out of the main entrance. So yeah, um, getting better at Eclipse, I think the only thing that's really bad about an Eclipsed Iron Man is the giant worms. But other than that, I think this challenge really isn't too hard. There's some hard variables, obviously, and we'll explain those when we get to them, but as far as experimentation goes, it's one of the, one of the easier ones. Our first item, flask. We have a power level 3 spider spawn right now, which is good. Uh, which means we won't be bothered that all that much. So now that brings me to my first concept uh, that I've learned while doing these runs and playing the game more and understanding the game more is there is a maximum power level uh, that you can have. And every enemy has a power level value. And for whatever reason, a Bunker Spider is a power level 3 next to Coilhead Bra and Bracken and Thumper. So, uh, for example, in this map, I believe the max power level is 7. And I think the minimum is like a 4. I could be wrong. I'll show it on screen right now. Uh, oh. Nice. Uh, let's hope this is open. Nope. Uh, we need a key now. Oh. Nice. 
Uh, so yeah, we kind of want to keep the, uh, we actually want to keep the spider alive just because of that fact. Um, cause he's taking up three power levels apparently and only, I forgot it does that. So there's only like four left and let's say we get like a, I don't know, is a slime a one or a two? I don't know. Let's say we get a two and a, and like a snare plea, then you know, nothing else really that harmful can spawn. So I'll gladly have the uh, the spider just hanging out somewhere on the map. All right, we've got poor items. Let's see if I can get two more, but I don't. I don't think there's much else I can really get here. Oh Jesus. I don't really think there's anything else for me. Yeah, we're just gonna leave. I think we got our one 150, so. There could also just be, like, barely any items on the map. This is also by far just the safest way back to the ship, so... I would prefer taking this, although I don't mind doing it the other way. It makes things easier. And faster. Yeah, we're only leaving with like four items, but as long as we're over a hundred, I guess I'm I'm okay with it. We'll just have to make up for it on uh assurance. That moon was no problem. Uh, 165, actually, we're good. That is, uh, that is the pace that I wanted to be at. Alright, next up we got Assurance. One of the harder. Um, maps in this rotation, I believe. Just because of the, um, the route you have to take and walk. And the sandworms are kind of annoying. But we're just gonna go straight for the fire exit. Because this will be our safest method of getting loot compared to the main entrance. $8 hairbrush, not too pressed if I don't bring that one back. It's a really low roll for that item. $32 cookie mold. And some bottles. Okay, we got a loot bag. I want his bottles, so... <clears throat> you know what? Let's go depot and let's go uh, main entrance. I want to double dip. Or, matter of fact, let's save time. Let's drop this stuff off here. We'll come back to it. And we're gonna go main entrance now. I 
Nice. Okay, yeah, this is a good idea. The uh, loot was pretty insufficient at that fire exit, so... Uh, but we kind of need to be in and out. Oh, okay. A B type. Being carded by a turret. I can do the B type and the apparatus and then call it. Or I could be really greedy and check. Oh, there's a angry little fellow. Um, no, we'll go apparatus and be done. There's an angry loot bug somewhere, I keep hearing it. Pretty funny. Okay, so we're gonna travel light first. Hey, dog. Oh, wait. Alright, so I screwed myself over. <laughs> I shouldn't have done that. I wanted to kill the dogs, but now I'm at 264, which is awful. Um, I need to make like, well, okay. We can still make our money back in Vow. Find it. I need at least, <clears throat> let's see. I need like, 300 more. Alright, next up is Vow. I'm not looking forward to this one, but we have to make um, 250 at least, since we have, yeah, 264 on the ship. We just gotta make about 250, and then we will get an OT bonus, and then we'll be able to go to Rend. I see we got really bad giant luck already though. Alright. Let's go. Let's get one inventory of loot and ditch our shovel and flashlight. Well no, we can't get a $250 inventory. We gotta make like two trips. Would just re I should have just restarted the run actually. Now that I'm here. Kinda messed up by not. Apparatus. $42 flask. Okay. Huh. I'm happy with this. Um, maybe we don't need that. But oh yeah. Oh, I'm a happy little camper right now. Hey. He closed the door on me? That's kind of funny. Let's just grab our apparatus. See if there's any more loot. No. We're saying goodbye to the shovel, too. 
Oh no, he didn't close the door. Alright, it was already opened. We just have to very slowly make it to the ship. Okay. I like it. I like how much money we've got right now. It's solid. Um, actually kind of doable. Oh, he's way over there. He's kind of guarding the main entrance, huh? I wonder if that's our giant from the start, or if that's a uh, different one. Okay. He saw me. He's in the valley now. Five oh four? Yeah, wait, that's actually that's how much I wanted. It wasn't two fifty, but two forty ish. Pretty solid. Okay, this is uh this is actually doable. I thought that was unrecoverable. Now it is company building time. Sell everything for maximum uh, overtime bonus. So yeah, the first three maps are actually like the the I wouldn't say the hardest, but they're some of the most annoying to deal with. So I'm glad we got those out of the way. Like Rend and Dine are actually pretty easy uh, for outside eclipsed. Offense is easy. Uh, March might will probably just be harder, um, but I think, like, Assurance and Val were the hardest ones, to be honest with you. It's more so the interior, the interiors of, of the rest. But even still, I think I can manage. This might actually be doable. Is there something else in the ship I'm missing? Oh yeah, there's a steering wheel. 26. All right, let's see what our overtime bonus is. We did drop our flashlight and shovel actually, so we kind of need those back. Okay, 60 is good. Let's go back. Oh. Oh, I actually brought the shovel, the flashlight back. I, I, I forgot. Uh, so yeah, we just need a shovel. That's a set. 538. Ugh. Oh, that's right. I didn't buy a flashlight. I forgot. Just a shovel, because we actually do have a flashlight. <clears throat> Alright, so next up now is offense. This one's fine, because um, we just have. It, the, the exterior is really easy. So I'm just going to hit the jump. Yeah, I mean, this is, uh, this is kind of a free moon. Uh, the only problem is there's like an 11% chance for, uh, coilheads to spawn and like a really high chance for thumpers to spawn, but we just don't want coilheads on the map. Thumpers are fine. That's about it. Never scan stuff up, like on heights. Can you? I hate it when they don't aggro properly. It just throws me throws me off so hard. Okay, we can only take like one or two more hits now. Mm. Okay then. Two items? Is that really what we're gonna go with? Nah, I'm, 
I'm not leaving with two items. Come on now. Come on now. I'll bring back two items. Just see what we can grab in like the in, in like the front right there. And then dip. So there wasn't there there really wasn't much where I was, so that it's all probably near the main entrance. My footstep audio is so laggy. Okay, that could have been un unfortunate. Oh, we're good, we're good. Uh, yeah, we don't have too much time. Just hope a coil head doesn't meet us at the main entrance. A bunker spider will. Oh my... Really? Got a remote. It's another tea kettle here. <laughs> Politely opens the door. Uh, you want to come in? There you go, buddy. See ya. Uh, slime. Oh, that's tough, man. Okay, there's a slime, a thumper, a spider, and a coil head all like right next to each other i don't know if this is enough we like really gotta pull out pull through on uh, march now but we also we also have uh rent so it everything everything should be fine we should be good to go 164 Ooh. This is a bad pace. Very bad pace. <laughs> well, we'll have to go crazy on March. That slime would have blocked the main entrance eventually, and I would have just been screwed. And there's no door um, to close. So if anything, the slime actually might have been the biggest deter right there. Alright, next up is March. Um... Yeah, like I said before, we need like 400, 350, 400, and I'll be happy. But we'll see how that goes. After this challenge, I, I'm going to take it a little bit easier in the next few videos. We're going to do some more fun stuff, I think, because I've just been torturing myself lately. Um, I thought this was going to be easier. It is easier than my last challenge, for sure, but I mean... This one is also taking quite a few attempts, I'm not going to lie. Oh, I don't like how big this area is. I'm afraid of giant open areas. Oh my god. Really? Okay, there's a fire exit here. We can play off of instead, maybe. Uh, what's this one? Is this a good one? Yeah. 
Nice. I like that. We're hugging the right wall on our way back, I believe. Check for apparatus or anything else. Nice. That's for you, guy in the comments in one of my videos that called me a monster for not using the air horn. That one was for you. Oh, no, no, we have to go that way. So we, we were hugging the right, yeah. Oh, audio is so laggy today. What is with this guy's pathing? Nice one, idiot. That guy kinda just sucked. Oh sh scare the crap out of me, dude. Interesting. Oh. Interesting. Okay, there is a lot of potential in this run in this run right now. Oh. It is so interesting. Oh my god. Okay, we make one trip. We make one trip to the ship. Then we make another trip for the rest of my items. Ditch that. We'll buy another one if we have to. Uh, it's not a good idea to ditch that, actually. Should ditch the flashlight instead. Let's get this back. Let's go to the other fire exit, get as much as we can, and uh, call it. Nice. Uh, let's go with the shovel and dish it if, ha if, if need be. Don't want to jinx it, but I don't... There's no giants yet. It's not to say that there won't be any. There's just not any yet. It could be huge. Okay. Now, how did we... We went this way. Yep. We just went straight all the way here, and we also dropped an item over here. It's the big bolts. Okay, that's fine. We're okay. We are okay. Let's see how much this is, and we'll determine if we should go to the uh, other fire exit. I don't think there's anything else I can do here. All right. Eighty-one dollar air horn. Five hundred fourteen in the ship. I mean, yeah, we got like 350. All right, I'm leaving. I'm, I want to move on. I want to go to Rend. Three oh nine. That's close to what we wanted. 
pretty close. 300 is not bad, still. Alright, so here is the rundown. With 473 in the ship, okay, I forgot, I missed, I got excited, okay. 473 in the ship, 538 in the bank, right? So we need to make 876. Things are going to get weird, but we don't need to, th let's not think about it too much. We're just going to go to the company building. And we need to sell... Well, they're buying at 77%. Hold on. Let me maximize this. What is my cheapest item? It would be this bolt. This is the cheapest I can sell. Yeah, we need 12. So, this is going to be a little bit over. And that'll be fine. So far, I'm, I'm pretty happy with this run. I think... I think no matter what, this is the one that goes up on YouTube. So I can kind of introduce you guys to the run, kind of get a good idea of what's going on. Because uh, I will, I mean, it's either me or Chef Austin that's going to beat this thing first. And right now he's doing some training. That guy is, uh, that guy is in the trenches right now. Alright, so we're at 559. Yeah, if you guys don't know, um, Austin has been, my friend Chef Austin, uh, has been doing basically all the hardest maps, like ripping the band-aid off on, ev on all the maps that everyone hates. He's playing Eclipse only to see how far he can get. He did Experimentation, he did Val, and now he's doing Offense. I think he just released his Offense today. If you want, it, if, if you want more of a of a background behind like this run and what goes into why it's kind of hard I mean you should go watch that I mean obviously it's not too bad it's just Eclipse weather and it's a normal Iron Man so it's nothing nothing too bad all right anyways enough enough uh, chitter chatter okay wait mm, I forgot to get a flashlight all right so now we're left with 416 in the ship. I we're just gonna get as much as humanly possible on rent. Six dollars left. We're at rend. Eclipsed. So we're just gonna go fire exit here. Not like there's a giant over there, which that's not good. So let's actually just go main entrance instead. I was gonna go fire exit, but main entrance should be fine. I think this is the right choice. Goal is to make it to dine. Let's see if we can finish the challenge. There's just so much loot potential on this map. Just don't want to run into a coil head or jack in the box, and as long as that happens, we're fine. Even if there's a coil head, as long as there's not a second coil head, <laughs> I'll be happy. Alright, so everything is upstairs. Uh, Bracken? Okay. Ooh.
don't need this for now. I want to kill that Bracken. Hey, come here. Come here. Come here. I'm, st I'm looking at you. Guys, that is the first time I've ever killed a Bracken in this game. You have no idea how happy I am about that. Oh no! Way to ruin it. No way. Oh, I'm so pissed. I'm going to dine, dude. Fuck that. Fuck that, I'm going to dine, dude. What does he know? How much do we have? Holy moly. Yeah, this ain't half bad, alright? sucks right after that awesome victory too oh I hate giants so much and he's walking towards the main entrance he's right where I need to go what time is it outside five I want one more trip please just one more trip, please. Please. Can I get the scrap, please? Okay, doable. One more, one more load. I've been at it all day I'm gonna hang it up I wanted to get a video out tomorrow so I just wanted to introduce the concept of the hardcore Iron Man there's a lot of nuance to it but I think it's very doable um, I will make it a whole ordeal when I do beat it um, but I I got the I finished the goal that I wanted to. We clutched up for one. We clutched up on Val. We did pretty decent from what I remember. We just didn't have a great we just didn't have a great start. That's all there is to it. Um and the Giants I think are just the worst part about um a hardcore in general. So yeah, I mean it's nice casual made it not too long for you guys hopefully um just introduce wanted to introduce the hardcore iron man um challenge because this was pretty crazy i mean i had coil heads i had thumpers i mean we had everything so i hope you guys enjoyed um i definitely have learned a lot about how i want to tackle this challenge uh today was the first day trying it so yeah see ya <laughs>